welcome back to this uh, channel uh, I would like uh, to look at now it says this is a form to work and uh, a very interesting topic and uh, maybe to start with we can ask ourselves what are indices or what is index so indices these are the powers to which a number is raised for example we have seven squared uh, three power four then uh, the two power five uh, this squared this power four this power uh, five these are the index or the indices so it says is nothing much but a power to which a number is raised then now uh, let's look at uh, laws of indices We have quite a number of rules, and uh, I will start with the first one where we have a scenario of an example like a power m times a power n. Uh, this is <clears throat> when you are multiplying two numbers and we have the same uh, base, then what do we do with the powers or what do we do with the indices? We usually say. This is going to be a power m plus n. We add the powers. So whenever you multiply two numbers, they have the same base. Then we add the powers or we add the indices. That is the first law of the indices. Maybe uh, to demonstrate this, I can have an example here where we have... Uh, x squared uh, times x power 4 x power 4 what do we get when we have x squared times x power 4 so in this case we're going to be having x squared now because the bases are the same uh, x is called the basis we add the power plus 4 we get x power 6. So that's how we get to that. Uh, that's how you saw that. B. I can have another example there. B. We have 2 cubed times 2 squared. So when you have a scenario like that, how do you solve that? Using the indices, we just say the bases are the same, both are 2, so we add the power. So we have 2 power 3 plus 2, we get 3 power 5, which is the same as 32. Uh, 3, sorry, we get 2 power 5, which is equals to 32. So that's how you so uh, the same you can have when the 2 power 3 is 2 times 2 times 2 to demonstrate that to get uh, this is 8 then 2 squared this uh, 2 times 2 is 4 then 8 times 4 is going to give us that t 2 there uh huh can I have another example uh we have a question like this so for y So for y, uh, we have 8 power 2y minus 1 times that 2 power y is equals to 16 power y plus 1. We have to solve for y in that case. So, the first thing we do here, uh, you write this number into a base. 
that is going to be common if it is possible. Like in our case, you can see 8 that 2 and 16, they are all multiples of 2. So you can write them into the base of 2. Like this, 8 is 2 power 3 into bracket 2y minus 1, then times that 2 is 2 power 5 to bracket y, then 16 is 2 power 4 to bracket y plus 1. Then we open this bracket, we have uh, 2 power 3 times 2, 6y, 3 times minus 1, 1 is minus 3, times 2 power 5y is equals to 2 power 4y plus 4. When you do like that, can be good to see that uh, on my left hand side, uh, have, uh, now the pieces are the same. So this multiplication, we add the power. So you can have 2 power 6y minus 3 plus 5y is equals to 2 power 4y plus 4. And then, uh, as you're able to add this one, you get 2 power 6 plus 5 is 11y minus 3 is equals to 2 power 4y plus 4. So uh, we have the same base here, 2 power 11y minus 3 is equals to 2 power 4y plus 4. Now, when the bases are the same and the base is equal to that, then we drop the powers and then we have uh, that 11y minus 3 is equals to 4y plus 4. Then we put the right term together. Uh, y, you can take it on this side. And then 4 uh, minus 3 on the other side, we have uh, 11y. Then uh, this is going to be minus 4y is equals to 4 plus 3. So 11 minus 4, that is going to give us uh, 7y is equals to 7. And we divide by 7, we will say y is equals to 1. So that's how we solve that kind of a, a question where you are required to uh, solve it using uh, the indices. Good. Let's now look at uh, the second row. That is the row uh, when you have division. Second rule has a slurry form like a power m divided a power n. So, whenever you are dividing two numbers having the same base, now what will be the powers or the indices? We subtract them. So, this is going to be a power m minus n. So, whenever you are dividing two numbers having the same base, uh, then you just subtract the powers. That is the second law of the indices. We can have an example here uh, where we have a 7 power 15 divided by 7 power 14. So this one, using the indices, we're going to have 7 power 15. We have the same base. Base is 7, base is 7 here. So you just subtract the powers. Uh, 15 minus 14, we get 7 power 1 is the same as 7. That's how we see that kind of a equation. Uh -huh. okay, this is example A. Let's have example B here uh, to have a clear picture of the same. Uh, I have x power 16. The right and power 12. Mm -hmm. So, when you look at this kind of a question, uh, the bases are not the same. We have one is x, the other one is 12. So, in this kind of a scenario here, 
uh, we leave it like that because the basis are not the same. So in that case, uh, the are your question is the answer. So let's look at another example. See, uh, we have that two power x minus three. Divide x power x minus 4 is equals to 64 divided 2 power x. We have a question like that. We have to solve it. And now, having the knowledge of indices, uh, this one will not be a big problem to us. So the first thing here, we can have this number into the same base because they are all multiples of 2. So we make them back. That 2 is 2 power 5. We take bracket x minus 3. Divide 8 is 2 power 3. And then bracket x power 4. And then 64, which is going to be 2 power 6. And divide 2 power x. Then we open a bracket there to 5 times x, that is 5x, 5 times minus 3, minus 15, divide 2, then 3 times x is 3x, really uh, 3 times minus 4, minus 12, and then is equals to uh, 2 power 6, divided by 2 power x. Now, this is division, and then our second row of uh, indices, Whenever you're dividing, you subtract the power. So this one can have it as a single uh, base here. 2 power 5x minus 15. This division will subtract this power here. Uh, really x minus 12. This is going to give us uh, 2 power 6. This is just another division. We subtract the power minus x. So you put this bracket here. 2 power 5x minus 15 minus uh, 1 times 3 x get minus 3 x minus times minus get plus 12. This is going to give us 2 power 6 minus x. So 15, uh, sorry, 5 minus 3, we get this is 2 power uh, 5 minus 3 is 2x and minus 15. Uh, plus 2 to get minus 3 uh, this is going to give us 2 power 6 minus x and then when you have it like that the bases are the same we drop them so you can work with powers now because this is equal to that so even the powers they are equal to one another so 2x minus 3 should be equal to 6 minus x so you put the right hand together and bring x on this side and then you know, do on the other side. So you have uh, 2x. This is minus, it's going to be plus x. It's going to be equals to our 6 now. Then minus 3. And now it's going to be plus 3. So 2 plus 1, 3x is equals to 9. Then our x is going to be equals to uh, 9 divided by 3, which is equals to 3. So, that's how you solve uh, that kind of uh, a question and uh, that is the first and the second uh, law of indices and that uh, mark the end of my session uh, thank you very much for watching